Welcome to a Mabel Story How To. In this video, I will show you three different ways you can travel around the Mabel world very quickly. For the first method, you have to set something up, but you only have to do this once. What you have to set up is where Spindle takes you to when you talk to her from inside the Mushroom Shrine. You simply do this by going to Henesis and talking to Spindle and going to the Mushroom Shrine. When you have done this, Spindle will then take you to Henesis when you speak to her from inside the Mushroom Shrine. And this will be used later when we are going through the first method. Let's take an example. You are in Aquarium and uh, all of a sudden you actually want to be in Edelstein instead. But you're not quite sure how to get to Edelstein and what is the fastest way. One of the fastest ways is to use the quick move system in the top left of your screen and then finding the tent icon which is Momijagaoka. This is the spawning area for Hayato and Kana. The thing about this place is that it is in the same region as the Mushroom Shrine which means that you can get to it really fast. There is a quick way to get there if you are level 120 plus. All you have to do is speak to the dimensional mirror and choose the uh, fight for Aswan place. Once you are at the fight for Aswan place, all you have to do is step right back into the portal you just spawned at and you will instantly be in Mushroom Shrine. We remember before when we set up Spindle, so she takes us to Henesis. Now we can use that and we will get to Henesis immediately. When you then are at Henesis, go ahead and use the quick move once again and pick the big ship, which takes you to the Victoria Tree platform. Jump down the ladder and go upwards until you get to the interdimensional portal. Speak to that, get inside, then instantly talk to interdimensional portal once again. You will then be able to choose which city you want to go to and you can just right here choose Edelstein if that is where you wish to go to. If you are not level 120, you cannot use the system where you go to fight for Aswan, use the same portal to get to the Mushroom Shrine, but there is a way around that if you are lower level. To get around this problem, first off go to Mushroom Shrine. You can just do this when you are setting up the uh, teleportation point from Mushroom Shrine to Hensis, and just go to the far right portal and keep on going into the portal to the far right. Eventually you will get to Sugartown. When you get to the map you see that I'm getting to where it uh, starts saying Sugartown up in the minimap description. You can just go ahead and use a return scroll. Once in Sugartown, go ahead and talk to Hikari and she will take you into the sauna. Once in the sauna, go ahead and speak to the NPC and buy some strawberry milk. This strawberry milk teleports you to a mushroom shrine, just like the other town portal scrolls, for example the one to Parion or Koenig City. But just like the other town portals, you have to be in the same region for them to work. But the thing here is that, that the Kana and Hayato spawning place is in the same region as the mushroom shrine. Therefore you can just go ahead and use the strawberry milk when you get there and you will immediately be at mushroom shrine. And then the process is just the same as, as I showed a little bit earlier going to the interdimensional mirror and choosing where you want to go. The second method is a method that is very useful throughout leveling. It can also be used as traveling, but it is very very effective when leveling up. It is the Maple Guide. I don't know if a lot of people actually use this. It's a little hard to find, but it is in the top left of your screen. You can see it right there, or you can just click U on your keyboard. When you have opened the Maple Guide, and uh, you will see all of these different points with levels on them. By clicking on all of these different bubbles or points, you can see a lot of different places, including monsters and party quests. You can move to some of these places depending on what level you are. You have to be in the required level range. You can see it when you hold your mouse over it, it says you can move here until level 85 or whatever it is. So throughout your level progression, you will be able to teleport to newer and newer places. This is just a really, really good method for finding places. For example, if you need a new spot to train and you are not quite sure where to go, you can check some of these places out. The third method is most relevant to the reboot server. You can use this method on the regular servers as well, but they are more relevant to the reboot servers as they have changed how you obtain this item. The item I'm talking about is the Hyper Teleport Rock. You can get it from the cash shop and on the reboot server it just costs mesos, which is really really pleasant. You can get them on the regular servers as well, but then you will have to pay NX for them. This is by far the most efficient traveling method of all there is in Mabel Story. You simply just open the map by clicking W, then going to uh, whatever region you want to, finding a map you would like to go to and just go ahead and double click on it and you can just 
click OK and it will teleport you directly to that map instantly. These were three quick tips for you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you do, uh, you can leave a like on it and I will see you in the next video. Peace.